I am Anil Kumar and here are two more examples of linear relations. We will try to understand the description, sketch a graph and then write an equation. So the question here is understand description of linear relations, draw a graph for each description and write an equation. First description is line slopes down from left to right and sum of coordinates is 10. Think about it. So we have a situation like this where this line is sloping down from left to right and sum of coordinates is 10. That really means that x plus y equals to 10. So that is the sum of coordinates, right? You could rearrange and write this as y equals to minus x plus 10. You get the idea. So where 10 will be your y-intercept. And what is going to be the x-intercept? Well, we can find from here. If I use y as 0, x is 10. That means we are talking about a line which is kind of like this. Do you see that? With x and y intercepts as 10. Right? So both x and y intercepts at 10. That is how the line is. And the slope of this line is minus 1. So the equation is, as we wrote, y equals to minus x plus 10. This equation is in slope intercept form and this equation could be written as x plus y minus 10 equals to 0 in standard form, right? So either way, so the equations are as given here and this fits fairly well with our description. I hope it's clear. Now part B is the x coordinate is always equal to y coordinate. Now what does that mean? That means that the line actually goes diagonally and x and y coordinates are equal means it goes through from quadrant 3 to quadrant 1. The points will be like you would consider a point as 1, 1, right? 2, 2, like this. So these are the points on the line, minus 1, minus 1. Slope of the line will be rise and run, same values, is 1. And therefore, we could write equation of this line as y equals to x. y equals to x means x coordinate is always equal to y coordinate. You get the idea? y equals to x x coordinate is always equal to that of y coordinate. So from the description you can easily get the equation. I hope that gives you fairly good understanding about the linear relations. I'm Anil Kumar. You can subscribe to my videos and learn a lot. Thank you.